remember that the Utah team charter had a bird strike to the engine of their Delta charter and had to make an emergency landing back in Salt Lake City. And Donovan Mitchell said, uh, I'm not getting back on an airplane anytime soon. Well, the one thing the Grizzlies had to be ready for is early energy from this Utah Jazz team. They, they are going to have to withstand an early run. You see the pick and roll and Jaron with a rejection and then battling Gobert and a foul. To reach in and commit a foul. Jaron is an important part of the puzzle. And for him, he has to find a rhythm. The only way you find a rhythm by being on the floor is Conley. Down to Royce O'Neal. Royce O'Neal having himself a career year, but really struggled in game one on both ends. Bogdanovich did not struggle with all 29 of his points in the second half. Loose ball, and it ends up in the hands of Dylan. Here's the boos, and then misses against Gobert. And the boos turn to cheers from the Utah crowd. You know you have arrived. When, when you touch the ball, the fans boo as Donovan Mitchell makes. And Gobert with the contest. And Valanchunas the miss. Valanchunas had 14 field goal attempts in the first game, and now Gobert is... Does such a great job of when he turns that corner and a defender is behind, he keeps the defender behind. That means that the big is in a predicament of does he step up or stay to the body of Valanciunas? Extra pass, Bogdanovich. Mitchell, another three. Royce O'Neal whiffs on the end. Conley, a floater from the foul line. Honeycombing in and out. Gobert, an offensive rebound. Knocked free. Jaron Ingles, 11 points in game one. Mitchell with a Euro step, that won't go. Rebound, tapped around and captured by O'Neal. O'Neal averaging almost seven rebounds a game in his fourth season with the Jazz. Bogdanovich forced inside the arc, skip pass. Ingles can't latch on to that. The rebound to Bogdanovich is that we have to be like Goldfish. Only have a, a memory of about 10 seconds. They wanted to forget game one. And Mitchell loose with the dribble and Morant will slam. Vision by Morant to find Kyle Anderson underneath. And we talked about the shooting. Donovan Mitchell against the Grizzlies this year was 10 for 14 against the Grizzlies. Something going. Grayson Allen missing the three, of course. Grayson Allen originally with the Utah Jazz. Clarkson better than 18 a game off the Utah bench this season. Did not make a single start this year. O'Neal, good cover up by the Grizzlies, but a great find. Lopper go bare, and that's a third foul. The Anthony, see that can have a look, get a little pep in his step on the offensive end. First points of the series for him. Clarkson a catch and shoot three. Offensive rebound became the first Southwest Division team to win a game in Salt Lake City this year when they won Game One. Mitchell with five to shoot against Morant. A sidestep, triple try, rimming no. Rebound to Bain. And then the Grizzlies can't get the offensive rebound. It filters out to Clarkson. Bogdanovich, he'll sidestep. He'll try for three. The Grizzlies, you run a high screen roll. Jaron pops. You don't have to settle for the jump shot. Because he had Morant's third assist. Donovan Mitchell favors offensive rebound. Mitchell trying to create space. Bogdanovich off the bounce, got to the cup. Xavier Tillman back in the lineup. Three starters down with three fouls. Bogdanovich, Clarkson, catch and shoot. And a loose ball foul on Roy Gobert returns for the Jazz. I said the Grizzlies partner can win this four minute span. Win this four-minute stretch so that you go into the locker room with a little confidence. Because the Grizz got to stop fouling. The Jazz, too many forays to the foul line right now. The hands are nice. Kyle. Kyle Anderson with a knockaway. Bogdanovich is back three on one. Boom! Boom! Kyle Am That's how you go. That's how you get that go-go gadget arm up there to finish those. Looking a little bit like Tayshawn Prince. Mm. And that one rolls in. Here's Kyle. Good deflection. Now just 
seeing who's coming. Do I need somebody? No, no. Take it myself. Finish with authority. Because that's a lot of half-court sets. It means you got to run a lot of sets. Grizzlies, they like to play a lot more free-flowing basketball than that. And so this right now has the Jazz right in their comfort zone. Niang off the bounce. Ingles shovels Bogdanovich a corner three. Put it in. Let's see if the Grizzlies can get multiple stops here to start this third quarter. And defend without fouling. That, that's going to be key. Bogdanovich with a pull up. Conley was plus 13 in the first half. Yeah, you, you know our affection for Mike Conley, but we hope that that stat is Mike. Morant with 31 9 in the quarter. Keep those broad shoulders going, young fella. Good Dylan, hands. Dylan, 8 of 9 from the floor overall. Bogdanovich, good closeout by Anderson. Bogdanovich will try from the angle. And Valanchunas finally gets a foul call to go his way. And the Grizzlies needed every one of those quarters, and he's got to continue to play big. He and Dylan Brooks are going to have to continue to lead this team on the offensive end. Favors off the pick and roll, and after quiet since then because of fouls, with two baskets here in this third quarter. Remember Dylan Brooks on the floor with four. Conley with the pump fake, floats it up and in. That's, a, that's an awful technical I, foul. I, I, I'm, I'm speechless because I didn't see anything there that would warrant a technical foul. Conley hits the free throw line for Morant, make it 10 of 14. 38 points for John Morant. Niang with a foul line gun, that's off. But Brooks taps the rebound and picked up by Clarkson. Niang for three. Great things go. Jazz, a top 10 team. They average 14 second chance points per game, but as you point out, 18 tonight. Conley dishes Niang Yang for three. Not there. And Clarkson and a half to be able to yell and scream at the top of their voices here in FedEx form. Make sure you got some lozenges. You're gonna need it. Nice knock away by Brooks. A look ahead. Jaron slam. Is in great hands with Morant. Jazz with Bogdanovich, O'Neal, Gobert, Conley, and Jordan Clarkson. Grizzlies with their starting five on the floor. Conley drew a foul and put it in. The magnificent performance by him. He has tied Mike Miller for the highest scoring game, regular or postseason. Mike Miller at 45. Go 45 and 7 with four boards for John Morant. This is the ninth time the Grizzlies have allowed 130 or more. Conley, Gobert offensive rebound and a putback. Free throws were early since he's played deep and big minutes. His free throw shooting has actually gotten better. Yeah, I think he started out, he's one for four. Early in this game, as you mentioned, and has been able to find the inner strength to continue to pick his game up. their three-point attempts from 35 a game last year to 43 this. And their percentage got better. 43% of their offense this year came from the three-point line. Mitchell. Rebound Gobert. Conley, an open three. And look at Royce O'Neal win. Well, I talked with Taylor Jenkins pregame, and I asked him, I said, what are the commonalities to teams that are successful in the playoffs? And he said they stay true to their identity, and the Utah Jazz have been able to stay true to their identity Ooh, tonight. Wow. Kyle Anderson, nice steal there, his third of the game. Nine here in the series, and they're going to take that away on an offensive foul. Point two. Mitchell. He could go in, it would have given him, given him a 50 piece. Kevin. 
Two minutes remaining, and the Jazz that far away from leveling the series at one. And a shot clock violation. Uh, they execute on both ends of the floor, and you give them credit. They executed in this basketball game here tonight, whether it was getting finishes at the rim, second chance opportunities, or knocking down threes. Bogdanovich a catch and shoot three, rebound Jaron, but lost it to Conley. Utah this year, 19-0 in the regular season, shooting 50% or better, they're at 54%. Valanchunas gets the run out off the turnover. Enough possessions to overcome that. Okay, so you, you give the Utah Jazz a pat on the back because they had to come out and have a Big time performance, and they did just that as O'Neal throws that one away. That's a key defenses video. Here there are all kinds of defense happen during the game, like man-to-man, -man, helps, rotations, off-the-ball defense, steals, blocks, forced turnover, and others. Get a video like this. Go on focusstatsdb.com in the video editing section. Insert the name of the player. Choose the type of the video and the number of games to edit. Leave your contacts to get all the materials.